Yeah, he's at yeah, the Yeah, I see him. Go to the middle. There's a generator. Fucking juked! Oh, <laughs> <laughs>What's going on guys, I'm Deadly Psycho and welcome back to another Dead by Daylight video. Today we're going to be talking about some quality of life improvements that Dead by Daylight needs to implement in their game. First of all, the biggest problem that I have with the game is the frame rate issues and I know they know about this issue and they're trying to fix it. I just don't know how long it's going to take for them to actually fix it or if they can actually do something about it or not. This is the biggest thing. I hate it so much when the killer kills me, even though I'm a few frames away or probably like 10 feet away because of the frame rate issues or the lag issues. I don't know what the deal is, but it's just really frustrating for stuff to happen when it doesn't look like it's supposed to be happening on your screen. A party system definitely needs to be implemented into Dead by Daylight. I'm tired of playing a game with my friends and then the game ends and then we all get kicked out and then we have to choose somebody to invite everybody else back into the party to start up another game it's just so frustrating time consuming and flat out irritating they need to add a party system to the game also with that being said i really want them to implement an instant spectate feature so as soon as you die you get to spectate your teammates and you can leave if you want so kind of like fortnite you can instantly spectate your teammates and watch them and then when the game ends if they win or lose you see all your stats and stuff right there and then you can back out or you can back out beforehand if you want to but i'm tired of seeing this menu that shows all my stats and then i have to press a button to go back in and spectate just alleviate all that and put the spectating first before everything else also cleaning up the menu layout is very important i hate clunky messy and just difficult to use menus and dead by daylight has by no means a difficult to use menu it's just really annoying that i have to use the analog stick to move my cursor around to get to the spot that i want to to choose what i want i want to just be able to click the d-pad buttons or something like that to choose what i want and i don't think this was difficult for them to do but they just left it as a pc port instead of actually fixing the menu system just a little bit just tweaking it a little bit to make it fit the console a lot better would have went a long way and the last thing i have is a little thing but it's really annoying get rid of all of the brown offerings i don't understand why they exist they're trash they don't have any place in the game because nobody's ever going to use them there's too many of them and there's just always better things to use and there's always more of the better things to use because nobody's going to use the cheaper ones when they're going to lose everything anyway if they do prestige their character or anything like that. So with these being said, these are my five things that I wish they would fix in Dead by Daylight. And hopefully they do. Hopefully this video can get to them and then they'll actually start taking action or start pushing harder for the things that they are working on if they are working on any of these things. Ladies and gentlemen, let me know down in the comments below what else you think should be changed, fixed, or any of that matter down in the comments below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Check out some of my other videos, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.